We also actually make um, blood sickles for them, too. It smells like a popsicle, but made of the meat blood. My favorite part with, with working with tigers is just the fact of that you can get that close to them. You know, I mean, where else can, can you be that close to an animal that powerful and that beautiful? Even in the wild, people rarely ever see them. And here we get to work with them every day. And you have to kind of take a step back and you're realizing, like, oh my god, I'm actually working with tigers. We have a lot of different enrichment things that we can put out in the exhibit. We can put different treat items in the boxes. Uh, we can give them bones. We can give them chicken pieces, just other meat pieces in there. Alden, see what I have for you? We also actually make um, blood sickles for them, too. So like the, like the blood from their meat, we can, we'll actually freeze it into like popsicles, and we give them that as well. A blood sickle. We call it a blood sickle, yeah. It smells like a popsicle, but made of the meat blood. <laughs> so this is the juice runoff from the meat that the tigers got today. So we're just going to add a little bit to each container. We just add some, some of the, uh, the meat juice to it to make it a little bit more enticing than just the plain water. The blood sickle for the tiger, that's just something we like to give them, uh, especially on hot days. This one's even got a little bit of the meat bits in it. I'll probably like that one. We're gonna add knuckle bones to these two. So these are knuckle bones for the tigers. Okay, our blood sickles are all done. Okay. The thing with working with tigers is really just the safety factor. We try to call each other in advance when we know that somebody else is coming to the building, so we're not startling either the cat or the person who's working in the building. You really just have to realize that, you know, how powerful they are, um, so you always have to be very careful with the way you treat them. It's always safety first. Let me open this door. Good boy. It's okay. Come on, Julian. Wait to see what I put out there today. Good boy. Have a good day. <laughs> Come on, Alden. You know, I mean, to be able to be that close to an animal that's so powerful and so beautiful um, and very rare, um, you can't beat it. <laughs>